what? What is this? This isn't MechWarrior. This is Guild Wars 2. Uh, yesterday there was a beta event, and I played a bunch of it, and recorded some, and thought I'd share some of the footage, and some of my thoughts about it. If you're interested in it, watch. If you're not, uh, you might even want to still watch, because there's also going to be some uh, channel updates, sort of news and things in this video, so go straight away into my thoughts on the Guild Wars 2 beta. Uh, it was an interesting event. Uh, it was a small area of the map, which I'm assuming is going to be much larger and many more levels in the eventual full release. Uh, you got to try out the Revenant with a limited skill set and two alternate sets of weapons, a hammer and a um, axe and mace combo, and offhand and mainhand. So it was pretty fun. The Revenant were felt felt quite durable, um, but they had everybody in celestial gear with, I believe, Doliac signets. You were always just regenerating health. Uh, if you're not familiar with the game, it just means that your stats were very balanced out, and that you had a, a an item on you that was making you regen health and be just durable. So, I'd like to see it with uh, an attack-oriented build, but. All in all, Revenant, pretty interesting. It's kind of like the mix between a warrior or a guardian and a thief, with a little bit of the thief's mobility and the warrior or guardian's uh, weapon skills and fun stuff. But the real interesting part of that was the gliding and the exploration of the map. That was so much fun. Gliding is uh, such an interesting concept. You just, what fall damage? There's no fall damage. I mean, you could still hit the ground and hurt yourself, but you can always just deploy your glider last two feet from the ground and come in for a nice soft landing. So that is awesome. That's one part of it I super enjoyed was just running around the map, getting up somewhere really high and then trying to glide and like get out of the map and like humongous falls that you would go through. It was great. Uh, besides from that, I'll, I just have a bunch of Guild Wars 2 footage, and I'll continue going on in the background. Uh, some new, some news, interesting things, is, uh, unfortunately, the Clan of Cat International has uh, been deactivated. And it's a, a bit of a time coming. The uh, We had a, a split a couple months ago, I want to say where a large portion of our more active players went off and made their own group called the Ashborn Warriors. And I, at least I believe that's how it went down. I think they made that or they joined it anyway. And so it, it was sort of a eventual thing. You know, there was not as many people there. The current command structure was only there because it fell to the next people in line and they weren't really uh, wanting to take over a clan so oh well it happens um, but there is interesting things that could happen to the channel of mine because pretty much everything in my stuff has been branded nova cat group thing all my videos have the nova cat symbol in the bottom left i find it fits in there very nicely beside my mech status so depends on what I want to do with my channel. Do I want to do it uh, Kanajashi uh, branding? Do I want to like switch over from branding of Novacat to branding of Kanajashi? Or do I want to maybe keep Novacat branding and have that as my thing? Or what? You know. So I've got to figure all that out. But... In the end, it won't affect the, you know, I'm con I'll continue to make tutorials, I'll continue to make the Road to Community Warfare, I'll continue to do that new series, which is the What I Would Choose, What I'm not, What I Would Choose, What I Would Change, um, which the, oh my god, that first video got so much damn attention, and in the background here, I'm just going to click into my YouTube channel and figure out how many views that thing had. It... It was amazing how much, uh, how many views that video got in such a short duration, like 24 hours or so. It got like a 700, 800 views, which for 
for my channel is ridiculous and is currently sitting at 1,175 with 78 likes and 2 dislikes and 21 comments. Holy crap, that is uh, big stats for me. So I do like making those videos um, as that it's really fun to sh like talk about this kind of stuff, talk about the balance changes or different mechanics of the game. So I'll definitely making more of those. I want to make one on ECM and targeting. Uh, I'd like to make one on some other topics, although now that I'm trying to think of them, they're not coming to my head in the, when I'm having a microphone in front of me, so I'll make more of them in the future. So, yeah, and then I guess the last thing would be that my uh, hiatus from work might be finished because I just got word that I have a job interview next week, which would be amazing. It would be a nice government job, and... I hope I get it. If I do, videos may slow down a little bit because, you know, I'll have a new job and I need to put my time into that, but I'm still going to continue to create videos for the foreseeable future as it's fun and I like uh, having feedback from you guys and meeting up random people in the game and being like, oh, hey, it's you, you know, well, let's play, let's, let's go here and do this strategy. Ah, oh, that's great. But anyway, uh, yeah, that's been an update on what's going on and my thoughts on the Guild Wars 2 beta. Uh, so, thank you for watching, and good hunting.